I can't look at it myself. Look at that sky, isn't it beautiful? Well, I can't look at it all. That is a gorgeous Whoa, sky. I can't look at it. <laughs> Our hens have been free ranging for the last couple of days, maybe about a week, and because we haven't put the fence around their chicken coop, we can't find their eggs. So they haven't been laying in the nesting boxes. So Penelope and I are going to do an Easter egg hunt and we're gonna go around the property and take a look for eggs. We'll probably look in like these longer bushes here. Like sometimes you can see where the chickens have, you know, gone in there and made themselves a little nest, but there's no eggs here. Let's keep looking. Why don't you tell us what you found? Well, you got two things there. You got some. This is a flower. That's cilantro flowers. Yeah, cilantro flowers. What's the other thing? And some holy basil. Some holy basil. right in between the steps here. There we go, underneath our steps, under our porch here, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven eggs, woohoo! So we found our eggs, now we have to figure out how to get them out. Okay, we got one, woo! We got one egg, two eggs. <laughs> let's count these eggs. Seven. Seven eggs, we got them all. Okay, so let's take these inside. Let's do a float test to see if any of them are old. Okay, Okay. so we have a glass of water and we're gonna do a float test on some of these eggs. I'm not sure how long they've been there. I think some of them have been there longer for about a week or so. Can I try one? We typically don't wash our eggs unless they have poop on them, then we, then we wash them. We're just gonna drop the eggs in one by one and then take them out. Here, I'll do the first one. Okay. And it floats, I mean, it doesn't float. It's, okay, it sinks to the bottom, so that means this egg is a good egg. Go ahead and do yours very carefully. This egg looks good. They're good. We don't want any rotten eggs here. Okay, so did our eggs pass the test? Okay, so all of our eggs passed the test and they sank, that means they're still good. If they were floating or, or sticking up at one end, that means they were a little bit old, but these eggs were probably laid within the last week. I think that there's still more eggs out there. I just don't know where. Okay, here are some nesting boxes, and it looks like we have two eggs from this morning. Yes, come and collect them for us. right here. They think they were trying to lay their eggs right here. Oh, and then they missed. They missed. Okay. We found one dozen eggs today and we're taking them into the house and we'll have them for breakfast tomorrow with these five cherry tomatoes that we also picked from our garden. Thank you guys for watching. We hope that you enjoyed this video and um, see you next time. Can you tell me how many eggs you have in your carton? Nine eggs, and look who's behind you. Uh, Crazy chicken. Uh,